All right, there are 23 million karate schools, really, in Greenwich Village, New York City. <laughs> Mainly because of the fact that, well, after you've graduated from a karate school, there's no better feeling than walking around knowing that you can wipe out your whole neighborhood. <laughs> But the big thing about it is before you break a brick or a rock, you must condition your hands. See, and you have to keep hammering away at a brick or a rock, wham, 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 until a big slab of callus forms at the side of your hand. Your hand starts to look like a foot. <laughs> Don't laugh, this is good, because you keep your hand in your pocket for about nine days, and if some guy attacks you, you take a swing at him, and even if you miss, the smell will kill him, see. <laughs> what you have to do, though, is you have to just keep hammering away. Wham, wham, wham. And you do this because it's very important. You can break a brick or a stick. Because if you're ever held up, some guy will say, give me your dough. You just turn around, break a brick, poof, stick, <laughs> then give him your dough. Here you are. Say, <laughs> Thanks a lot for the money and the show, fella. But before you break a brick, you have to go give off a loud shout, see? This causes your glands to secrete and your froth at the mouth is See, and then if you miss the guy, you can bite his leg, right? <laughs> but the thing is, uh, just your ha! And you can bust a brick. Ha! So I figured, look, why bother to break a brick or anything like that if I know this shout? Because I figure, if a guy's gonna hold me up, where is he? He's down a dark street. Why? Because he's nervous. He doesn't want any trouble. All he wants is my money. Here I come down a dark street. Why? Because I'm stupid. <laughs> but I know the shout. And the guy will put a gun in my back and says, give me your dough. I just turn around quick. <laughs> so here, take the gun. What's wrong with you? You see got the gun <laughs> So if you don't watch yourself, I'll shout again. And as a matter of fact, you give me your dough. <laughs> so I held up 18 people like that. I read, uh, the back of this magazine had a very nice move and it says if you're ever walking down the street and a guy puts a gun in your back, go into your front pocket, tighten up on your elbow, and you whip around hard and fast, catch the guy right up in the forehead. <laughs> this knocks him back, you turn around, grab him, throw him down, pick up the gun, march him right off to jail. Now this is a good move. And I went home and I practiced this on my brother. And I wiped him out. <laughs> I got so good I would walk down nothing but dark streets with $10 bills hanging out of my pockets. <laughs> and it happened. Give me your dough. Went into my pocket, tightened up, whip, turned around, it was a midget. <laughs> so what are you there? What are you, some kind of song and dance man or something there? Give me that dough before I blow your kneecap off. <laughs> anyway, if ever, you graduate from the school, you have not reached your ultimate goal. That is to get attacked. You must walk around looking passive. See, and you do that by walking weird looking. You know, and sure enough, some guy will say, ah, look at that guy walking weird over there. Isn't he something there? He'll come over to strike. Remain passive. When he raises his arm, you grab the lapels of his jacket, drive your forehead through his. <laughs> Then you come around quick, drive your hands down across the shoulders, breaking all of the bones in the shoulders and the rib cage. You come down, you rip off his right leg and his right arm, you beat him in the head with both of them, you put the leg back where the arm was, the arm back where the leg was, you cut him in half with the right hand swipe, go into his eye, pull them both out, grab the Adam's apple, pull that out, tie them both up into a knot, let them go back, and then you turn them upside down and you pull them up into a ball and you throw them down and you jump on them and then you walk away passively. <laughs> See?